Wet, heavy snow coming in late last night into this morning caused a headache for many people in central Massachusetts, especially in the Blackstone Valley, where residents got hit hard by the storm. The National Weather Service says more than a foot of snow fell in the area, forcing shovelers and road crews to spend most of their day cleaning up. Our Roslyn Flaherty joins us live now with more. Roslyn. Olivia, this is the aftermath of more than a foot of snow in the Blackstone Valley. We're in Sutton on top of the snow pile and today crews say they were caught off guard because they weren't expecting this much snow. More than a foot of wet, heavy snow buries the Blackstone Valley. It's one of the hardest hit places in Massachusetts and the cleanup is difficult. It is good exercise, but uh, you know, I don't need all this exercise. It is heavy. I'm old. I'm 70. It's really good for sledding and making snowmen. The National Weather Service says 13 inches of snow fell on Northbridge. Highway Superintendent Jamie Lucchini says they were not expecting this much snow and had to adapt by putting more crews on the roads. Just kind of hoping we would turn into page on spring and now we're back to February. Nearly 40 pieces of equipment were working during the storm. The goal is to clear and treat roadways before the snow freezes overnight. All the building cleanup and the sidewalks especially. we got to get the snow blowers out. They're actually backing them out right now so we can have school tomorrow and get all the sidewalks in the school areas, which that'll be the challenge. Homeowners like Dennis Larson are trying to get ahead of the freeze. He spent hours cleaning off his property. I got two cars, as you can see. The... Uh, one is still buried. I'm working on the sidewalk to get to it. Shovelers say although it's been a mild winter, they are ready for the warm weather to come. January 2nd, I'm ready for spring. I'm always ready for spring. Always, always, always. The highway superintendent says things will freeze up tonight, so be careful if you're going out on the roads. Live in Sutton, Roslyn Flaherty, Worcester News Tonight.